Then the president talked about Venezuela. That's the country we should be going to war with, he said. They have all that oil, and they're right on our back door. He continued on, rambling and spitballing about whatever came to mind. Uh, I think that's interesting, (laughs) to say the very least. Like, everyone knows, like, out in the open now, but it's somehow... So, like, when Nancy Pelosi supports this coup stuff in Venezuela and pretends she's for the people... What Nancy Pelosi is really revealing is that she's a sociopath. And I'm not saying that that's not hyperbole, that she's a sociopath because she knows this is the actual truth. And she's and she's for overthrowing. She's for arming rebels, causing a civil war. She's all this horrible stuff. And I'm not just picking out Nancy. I'm picking on her because she's the leader. Everybody in Congress is like this with Trump, pretty much. Everybody's okay, And they know that it's they know that this is what it actually is. It's a it's a it's a grab for oil. Everyone knows this, except somehow the American people are still deluded because everybody on every corporate news show and lots of lefty news shows repeat the government propaganda. Maduro's a bad guy. He oppresses the election. That's propaganda. That's called manufacturing consent. Why do you think they have to tell you every time they want to overthrow, uh, do a regime change, illegal war on a country, they have to first tell you how bad their leader is and how he press. You know what that's called? That's called manufacturing consent. That's how you manufacture consent for your regime change war. You tell everybody that Saddam Hussein is a maniac who throws babies on the floor from incubators and then everybody wants to go to war. You tell everybody that Assad gasses his own people and then everybody wants to go to war. You tell him Maduro doesn't do real elections and he oppresses his own people and they're starving while he's eating steak. And then you go in and you go. So when you repeat, the people go, no, no, that gives me credibility. If I admit that Maduro's a bad guy, you have no way. They're all bad. Name one country where the guy isn't a bad leader. 